Welcome on in guys and welcome to another video. This time we are going to be looking at dropping some bombs in the F-18 Hornet. So on board we have got 8 JDAMs ready to go. Uh, so let's uh, get ourselves up into there. We have a target area just to the south of us. I have uh, got some green targets set up on. So we're going to have a look at dropping, uh, dropping some of these bombs on those. Okay, let's get to moving. So pretty straightforward in the F-18. You can rip off uh, four bombs, no problem. So let's go ahead and do that. Alright, so let's go to the stores page and uh, select our JDAMs. Those are going to take a little bit to uh, warm up here. Uh, we are going to be going in on target of opportunity mode, so we're going to select target of opportunity. We have to do that for each station. We just step through the stations until we have all four stations. Target of opportunity choosing, we're going to set to instant. Those are pretty much ready, so we just need to wait for those to get aligned by the time we get up in there and uh, have a look for our target. We should be ready to uh, put our designations into. Make sure we are at half flaps. Trim is set. Let's uh, start warming up the uh, flare, get that ready as well. Here coming up. Okay, we're going to use the uh, helmet mounted display uh, for target designation. Let's turn that on. Let's make sure our RWR is on as well. Go to the early warning and let's turn that on. Put those early warnings on the HUD as well. Okay, so. To designate with the helmet mounted display, we're going to switch on air to ground mode. And we're going to press up or forward on the, the uh, sensor select switch. Then going to give us this uh, symbology on the HMD. And we can see our target area over there. Let's uh, go ahead and zoom in a little bit here. And if we press the designate switch while the uh, HMD is solid, yeah, I'm not pushing. There we go. We have our uh, diamond. Alright, so let's uh, put the flare on our right MFD here. There we go, we can see uh, we now have display of our target zone. Let's uh, change that to FLIR. And the app FLIR and the lightning pod are very similar. We're currently using the uh, lightning pod on this run. 
that was my mistake here. I uh, unselected there. Right select the MF, uh, right select the and soy the MFD here. Okay, and we're gonna zoom in. And we're gonna go for those four tanks here that we have. So what we are gonna do is now we are still on the JDAM page. We're gonna go to JDAM display and we're gonna go to the mission page. We're going to have some coordinates here. It's going to be highlighting the uh, coordinates that we first put in. So we're not going to worry about that. So we have our station three. You can step through each of the stations. We're going to start on station three. And what we're going to do is we're going to Select, uh, select our four targets, we're going to designate each target, so uh, let's zoom in on him, and we're going to designate, and that's going to put the coordinates into that JDAM. We're going to step to the next station, we're going to designate our next target, step, designate, and designate. So those four targets are now uh, designated in each of the stations. If we cycle through we'll have a four coordinates here. So we are all good there. So next we're going to hit return. We're going to go to quantity and we're going to select each station. Okay, simple as that. We're going to now turn towards the target so Master Arm can come on. We're going to get within the zone. Okay, heading towards the target. Six seconds till we're in the zone. Let's do a battle out home. Okay, we're in the zone. Simple as all we're gonna do is we're gonna press and hold the pickle button. And that is gonna drop a bomb from each of the four stations. Pickle, bombs away. And those should be good. We should have four dead targets very quickly. So we'll just slow ourselves down here. target area. They are not far from going in. seen an impact any second now. First one dead, second one dead. Third, 
and to four. There we go, four bombs in quick succession using the mission page. Now you can also do it using mark points. So let's uh, go ahead and uh, do that. So let's uh, unselect the stations here. Go back to return. Back in target opportunity mode. Okay, so looking at our TGP again, make sure we are selected. We're going to pick four targets here. Now, if we have our HSI up on the left MFP, you're going to see the mark, the mark button here. So what we can go ahead and do is we can pick our targets again. So if we designate hit the mark button, pick another target, designate, get ourselves so we're not masked here, so designate, hit the mark button, Designate, hit the mark button. Designate, hit the mark button. Okay, so we've done that. So on the HSI again. Get ourselves uh, a bit of hold here. On the HSI, you're going to see our waypoints here. So we're going to scroll down. So we've got mark point one. If we hit waypoint designate, you can see it's going to show. Mark point two, waypoint designate, and it shifts again. Waypoint three, waypoint designate, and waypoint four, waypoint designate. So you see it's shifted between each of those targets. So now all we need to do is. Uh, we're going to select each of those. So let's start back at uh, mark point one. We point designate. We'll get turned around again. And we'll drop the next four bombs. So we should be not far from being in the zone here. We're very nearly in the zone now. Okay, we're in range, so we can go ahead, pick all. So let's pick all the one. Waypoint designate, waypoint two. Pick all. Change the waypoint again. Pick all. And pick all, so that's four away. Four away onto those targets. And four dead targets. Or three. <laughs> we weren't quite uh, spot on the money with our uh, designation on uh, one of those. But you get the idea. Nice and simple. Actually, it looks like the uh, R2 might actually just burn away there. So that is uh, the JDAMs uh, in two different ways of dropping the bombs to get
can quickly ripple in the mission mode or you can uh, use more points. Anyway guys, hopefully you have found that video helpful. Hopefully you'll join me in the next one and have a look at some laser guided. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching, take care and I will catch you in the next one. Bye for now.